Well, in the wake of the recent train derailment in Ohio, a railway group is advising Hamilton's National Steel Car to halt the use of hundreds of its rail cars following the discovery of what they're calling loose wheels. Jason Gaidola brings us the latest. Eight newly manufactured rail cars for U.S. carrier Norfolk Southern sit idle in the St. Catharines yard today. And according to a railway trade group, hundreds of similar freight from Hamilton's National Steel Car are under investigation following the latest derailment in Ohio. The Association of American Railroads tells CHCH News two days ago, Norfolk Southern identified loose wheels on a series of steel coil cars that presents an increased risk of an out of gauge derailment and have initially identified 675 cars manufactured by National Steel are subjected to this advisory. The Railroads Association went on to say the wheel set defect is uncommon. While it's unclear if it caused the derailment, loose wheels could potentially lead to one. On the home front, National Steel Car responded to CHCH News saying it provided records to the Association of American Railroads and Norfolk Southern with respect to three wheel pairs on the two rail cars of concern that were in the train consist that derailed. CHCH News asked National Steel Car to clarify the 675 rail cars in question and they have yet to respond back. Norfolk Southern says there was unusual wheel movement in the latest crash in Springfield, Ohio last week. National Steel Car tells us that to their knowledge, no conclusions have been reached as to any cause of the Norfolk Southern derailment on March 5th, and it is fully cooperating with the investigation.